Yeah, I started William making... William has a new crock pot that he's yet to really talk about on this show, but he talks about it pretty much continuously off stage, And uh, he makes <laughs> soup. <laughs> Why would you tell these people that? I just lost a bunch of fucking street crud. Holy shit. I had a whole bunch of street cred with everyone, and now I think it's fucking lost. But honestly, I made some wonderful pasta for Jewel last night. <laughs> Seriously, it was to die for. I added some lentils. I started adding a bunch of lentils to my soup. Uh, I added some extra cups of water because I put so many pasta shells in there. It was to die for. Oh, my God. Absolutely incredible. And this is a real thing. So you have all these things. You're using the crock pot on a daily basis. We're talking about yeah. breakfast soups, lunch soups, dinner soups. Dinner, yes. And I've been having these horrible blowouts, which is... What type of blowout are we talking about? I, I sit on the toilet. I start pushing. It's some delayed spray noise. I don't know how that even fucking really? works. I can't believe you have wet shits when all you eat is soup continuously. This yeah, is I, don't, I don't know either. How would it get solid? I fucking start pushing, and there is a delayed spray noise. I don't even know how that works. There's a spray noise. It a fucking delayed, gets everywhere. A delayed spray. I'm trying... Like, I'll start pushing, and I think it's already coming out. It feels like it's coming out, but it's like this delayed spray noise into the water. Danny Brown. How are you, William? What's going on this week with you? Doing good. I made a really good, uh, towards the end of last week, a really good spicy 15-bean soup. Oh, wow, yes. For those of you that don't know, William recently got a crock pot and has been eating exclusively soup. <laughs> Him and his girlfriend keep just making soup, breakfast, lunch, and fucking dinner. Breakfast soup and fucking this soup and that soup. Tell us more about the soups that you had yeah, this week. Yeah, so it was a spicy... How excited are you about this soup thing? I'm honestly very excited. It's been sort of a life changer for me, just making these soups out of the crock pot. I don't know who the fuck is talking over there, but you need to shut the fuck up. <laughs> yep, I don't really give a shit anymore. I, I literally, I was attempting to make the 15 bean spicy chili. I fucking could only find like 12 of the beans. I couldn't oh. fucking... And oh. it really sort of threw a wrench in my plans. Wow. If you needed an extra bean, you should have just invited Michael Gonzalez over. Uh... <laughs> That's a Hispanic joke, Michael. Yes. Uh, so, William, you had uh, some bean soup. You had what appears to be 12 or 13 bean soup. Yep. And uh, what other soups have you had this week? You, name some of the, You love soup. Shit, yeah. I had uh, two nights. I had a really good uh, spicy bean chicken tortilla soup. Wow, still a lot of beans in this. Uh, I also had a pea soup. That one took like a day to prepare. It was a whole <laughs> bunch of peas in there. Wow, uh, pea soup. Who made them. that? R. Kelly? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this is one time just for this night, Austin, Texas. It's just us. It's just me and you. I'm kidding. No chance in hell. Uh, I love it. So, William, can you name a few more soups? Yeah, I mean, I also had a uh, an Italian wedding soup. That one was pretty good. I also made a classic chicken noodle soup. One of the nights. Wow. One of the nights I made a macaroni. It's kind of like a macaroni soup. I put too much milk in the macaroni. So it was like a macaroni soup. Had that a couple nights. That was really good. Milkaroni. Uh, yeah, it was like a milkaroni. Yeah, I was just making the regular macaroni, and then I fucking, I'm a, such a clumsy person. I poured way too much milk in there. It turned into like a macaroni soup. Macaroni soup. Wow. <laughs> I do believe that's what they uh, serve in hell. <laughs> So, Macaroni William, you've been eating soup. a lot of soup. We get it. What are you, what are the, what are your bathroom uh, appearances like? Uh, quite frankly, I've not doo dooed in three days. Whoa, which doesn't make a lot of sense. I mean, these... I think it does. I think you're eating so much soup that you're just peeing everything out now. It's a liquid. Like, how would it even become a solid? Something's going on. It, it literally, it's scaring me to death. I haven't taken a shit in three fucking days. Uh, are there like, when you pee, do you see like pepper and meatballs and stuff coming out? <laughs> <laughs> even I couldn't keep a straight face on that one. This is such an immature episode of the show. Hey, William, when you pee, do meatballs come out? What? 
Like, yeah, I there heard was, myself say that. Dude. Yeah, there were some lima beans that came out after... I, that was I one of the beans I was able to beans. find. I did lima beans. that They were coming out of my thing. It was the weirdest wow. sensation. Uh, oh. And okay. I'm literally... I'm just trying to shit, and I swear to God, my stomach's hurt. It, it hurts right now. It's How hard as a fucking we rock. Put a bucket up here, and William should take his first shit in three days in front of all of us. In Tony, honor. I'm not kidding. I can't shit right now. Please don't make fun of it. I literally, I can't do it right now. I couldn't if I wanted to. I'm so excited to get an update on this poop thing of yours because I can't imagine a guy like you not pooping for three days. It's much weird. like the gun in your pocket. You are fully loaded right now. I am. My stomach is hard as a fucking rock right now. Really? Yeah, it's hard can as I, a can rock. Can I touch it? Yeah. <laughs> it actually isn't anywhere near as hard as I thought it would be. <laughs> it's incre- incredibly soft. <laughs> in fact, if I knew nothing about you and I felt your belly, I'd be like, have you only eaten soup for three weeks in a row? <laughs> that actually felt like a water bed or something like that. That is the opposite uh, of I thought hard. you were going to go along with that. I thought you were going to give me some street cred. And oh, say yeah, I felt hard a as a strong. rock over here. I was trying to flex my stomach when you did that. Yes. So. Hard as a rock made of water. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, William. Well, I know. I'm seeing how far I can go. I'm also seeing how far I can stand up here without having to take a shit. I'm literally about to shit in my pants. I ate For those uh, of you that don't know, William got a new crock pot a few weeks ago, and he's been exclusively only eating soup for three weeks. Uh,. Uh, William, what else in your real life has been going on? I mean, you got frozen in. What have you been eating? It's always interesting to find out. You have a very, very interesting diet. At one point, you were addicted to raisin bread and then prunes. And for the last three or four weeks, you got a crock pot and you are addicted to soup. He's been eating soup seven days a week. I mean, imagine, people. What kind of soups I, did you eat this week? Well, I actually found a really good restaurant called BJ's Roadhouse, I think, and I have been eating the takeout from there nonstop. I had a big uh, pizza and spaghetti and meatballs last night. Pizza, spaghetti, and meatballs? Yeah, both of them. Wow. Yeah, it was pretty good. I had my first solid shit today, and... Right. Literally three weeks. I don't know if you knew no 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 if you knew shit splashes everywhere. It's really it's really gross. Yeah, fair enough, man. Yeah, yeah, it's really gross. I don't know why you look so deeply into his eyes when you said that. Yeah, it's super gross. There's shit all up under my toilet seat if you lift it. Yeah, regardless, to be honest. Yeah. So what else is going on in the world of William Montgomery? The wild world of William. Well, I made some pasta fajoule earlier. Whoa! Um, Now Tom Papa famously makes his own bread. Uh, Tom uh, William recently got a crock pot, and he's been making a lot of different soups. He's been. Yeah, I made a really good pasta fajoule. I have to shit so bad right now. I know I always. Talk about shit, but it finally, I've been a couple of days. I think all the fiber I put in there, all the beans, it's making me need to shit right now. Jesus. I don't know Good. if it's that or just looking at Red Band's stupid fucking face. Oh. <laughs> Tom, what do you think? What did you just oh. fucking say to me? <laughs> I said, I don't know if I have to shit because looking at your stupid face or all the fiber in the fucking thing that I made earlier. Good thing you have a crock pot. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, William, I'm not going to let you and Red Band have one of your arguments. Don't do that. Don't yeah, do that. don't That's do a that. Bad idea. That's That'd a be bad a big idea. fucking mistake. I've started working out. See it? See how it hit that lady? You see how your piece of ice hit that lady? So remember right before when I told you that's going to be a big mistake? You fucking. Yeah, that was a big <laughs> fucking mistake, Red Band. It was. It was a big mistake. <laughs> he just sw- <laughs> That was a big fucking mistake, you dumbass. Yeah, he just, <laughs> it really was. His throwing arm yeah, is the same. stand up. <laughs> stand up. William and Red Band have a rivalry. <laughs> Will, Will, Will. It's very uncomfortable because I feel like he's staring at me when he's yelling at Red Band. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, oh, I got Red your Band. ass. Red Don't Band. fucking Don't throw do it back that. at me. Red Band. Red Band, you're so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> wow. This is a little... No. Stop it, you guys. Red Band, go to Red the Red Band, bathroom. I was kidding. 
Didn't you say you had to go to the bathroom? No, I saw what was in his hand, so I was trying to get out of the situation oh. for you, but then I just had to throw a lime on his dick. God. You hit my inner thigh. That you actually guys are literally the hurt. worst improv troupe I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> I have to shit. <laughs> so stupid. There's a lime in your ass. <laughs> I can't believe we saved this for the end of every episode. It doesn't really make any sense. Here he is, one of the stars of the show. I ain't passed to be shoe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have to go to the bedroom. I do. Apex twin. <laughs> We've seen this before, folks. Redman, you're fucking up that stupid noise. I'm not blinking that. I'm not winking that much. 